Mike and Zara Tyndall have a fun weekend in Rome. Mike and Zara Tyndall spent a weekend together in Rome, Italy, after the Rugby Stars reality series aired on TV. The couple, parents to Mia, 9, Lena, 5, and Lucas, 2, are huge golf fans and flew to the Italian capital to watch the Ryder Cup. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. Zara, 42, wore a sleeveless white ruffled blouse and her blonde locks were tucked into a white baseball cap. Mike, 44, wore a black baseball cap like his wife and was seen chatting to Dragon's Den star Peter Jones. It was Team Europe celebrating their victory over Team USA at the Marco Simone Golf and Country Club. Mike shared his joy over Team Europe's Rory McIlroy in an Instagram post, writing, I love this guy. Rugby legend Mike, who retired from the sport in 2014, hosted his annual ISBS hander Mike Tyndall Celebrity Golf Classic Fundraising Day for the Cure Parkinson's Trust and the Matt Hampson Foundation in May. Exclusively for the 2022 event, Mike explained how his wife Zara learned to play. He said, Zara started playing golf at Slingsby Golf Academy this year so she will be hitting a few balls, but she is also doing a great job raising money by selling mulligans on the course. My golf is a bit like the weather, changeable, but I really enjoy it, and it's a great way to spend time with friends. Mike and Zara's journey takes place immediately after Mike's two-part series, Grand Slammers, aired on ITV. This was followed by members of the winning England rugby team in 2003 coming together to train a team of prisoners to take on the Australian rugby team. On marrying into the royal family, Mike said, everyone thinks marrying Zara is a good thing, but that doesn't change the fact that you have to have a job. And it's not that simple, you know, you're quite institutionalized in rugby, it's a way of life, and you leave the game and it's not. I don't think you can ever describe it in any way, when you're so used to being around so many people and because it's ingrained in you to understand where you belong when you're no longer that person. If she were honest, Zara would say it probably took me a year to figure out who I was and who I was going to be. Then you have to find the next path, you can never replace him.